So today's video is going to be a fun one, hopefully. Um, it was certainly fun for Patrick and I to film this. Now, as you can tell by the title, it is a Get The Look video. And if you've been watching me on YouTube for a while, you know that I've done Get The Look videos for many years. I phased them out a little bit just because I was getting into my own style and really wanted to share that with you guys. Um, but I'm bringing it back during this whole lockdown with a little bit of a twist, a husband edition. Now, I put Patrick, my husband, on the internet for like six plus years now and over those years he's gotten so many comments just in general of who he looks like. Don't take it seriously, it's just in good fun, um, it's not meant to be like a serious thing and we just walk around thinking he looks like these male celebrities because we don't, he's totally his own person and, and like doesn't resemble them in many ways, um, but this is just meant to be fun and exciting to watch during this time right now, or just in general. Um, but I hope you guys enjoy it, and yeah, let's get started. Okay, so for this first one, I thought it would be really fun to do a Jim Carrey, uh, mainly because when I first met Patrick, it's probably the first thing that I thought of is his personality and his presence definitely resembles him a little bit. Um, so when I was trying to think of ideas for this video and like who we were gonna do get the looks for, I was like, we have to do Jim Carrey, specifically Ace Ventura. Okay, so Patrick's getting his hair wet because we have to do this iconic Jim Carrey Ace Ventura hair. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Like I said, we did this for Halloween, um, but I don't remember. I think it was like 2017, yeah, 18. So. Okay, I'll put up a picture um, so you guys can see it. If I already did or didn't, I don't know. You know, fun fact, I ended up trying so many of the products Tess has laying around the house. Cause like they're lying there, I'm like, hey, something fun could come in this. So I found a nice little hair regimen with half the stuff that she has. So that's always fun. <laughs> it's like a, yeah, you do have a lot more hair. That looks like, uh, what does that look like? A tidal wave. I think I'm getting it. You did well for my hair being so much longer than it than it was the first time around. So, so that little swoop de swoop he has on the top of his head, like from the side. Are you kidding? This looks so good. Boom. That looks just like it. Nailed it. <laughs> the side's like a little questionable. Like, <laughs> like what is that? But we, you know, working with limited products here. But this side, this is this is the A side. Jim Carrey's hair in that movie is insane. <laughs> okay, so for the outfit, the main thing is the Hawaiian shirt. He always wears these like crazy Hawaiian shirts. So I just got this off of Amazon and everything else we're gonna pull from Pat's closet. So he wears these like red pants. For Halloween, I did like a red and black stripe, which is more accurate to the movie, but it is what it is. We're gonna just do this belt and then he's gonna wear a white tank top underneath it and I think it's gonna look really good. I mean, Nailed it. Nailed it. This hair is pissing me off, but it's the best it's gonna get. You're such a trooper. Although this is such your look, like I can't get over it. I feel like you were meant to be this character. You gotta go to Soho like this. Yeah, you do. Like look absolutely crazy. Okay, make this face, hold on. Holy shit. <laughs> my favorite, this is already my favorite. DHS, sir. Sounds broken. Most likely. I'm sure it was something nice though. What's really sad is that's actually a broken vase I got. <laughs> Ventura. Yes, Satan. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. You sounded like somebody else. Now we've queued up the movie, so he's, I gotta get it right. He's fully in it. <laughs> I'm sure you already knew that. That's what turns me on about you. <laughs> so this next one, 
is a little bit of a joke in our friend group. Um, it is Youngblood, and our friends like to point out the similarities between Youngblood and Patrick. Um, just with the way he looks. I personally think it's like the nose, the face shape a little bit. I don't know much about him. I know that he's a singer. I know he dated Halsey for a bit. I'm not super familiar with his music, but I think it's gonna be fun regardless. So it'll be cool to see Patrick turn into, would I say punk? Would you say punk? I think it's a little on the punk side. I think you just want to see me put eyeliner on. Yeah, I think it's going to be cool. I think I've only ever put on eyeliner on you once for like an event. It's really uncomfortable. Patrick is going to be painting his nails twice this week. Um, so he's in for a treat. So we're going to do black. Yeah. Um, when I was looking up photos of Youngblood, I, um, I noticed he's worn black nail polish before. I don't know if it's a regular thing, um, but we're gonna go all out since this is, you know, somewhat of a get the look. The funny thing is too, Patrick could not have worn um, more opposite before <laughs> than like a matching floral terry cloth, like beach vibe. Nails, check. We're gonna let those dry. Then we're gonna do some, well I guess I could do the eyeliner now. Sure. So you're gonna look up? No, not in, <laughs> look up. All right. Oof. Oof, all right, that's a good like first start. He has it like super smudged. You're doing really good. He gave you a new nice eyeliner though. Whoa. We gotta smudge it a bit more. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, man. It's Yo, happening. it makes your eyes pop. This is the vibe I'm going for. I saw him in stripes quite a bit, so I thought it would be a safe bet. Um, I got this off of ASOS, Patrick has his own black jeans, and then I just got a bunch of chains that we're going to layer on, this like spiky necklace, and then we're going to mess up his hair, and I think it's going to look really good. So this is the original image that we were going for obviously with the stripes, but Patrick has like way different hair texture. He has like way curlier hair. So we're just gonna go like with this vibe, have the sunglasses up. He has a couple images like that, so it works. So this doesn't fit him. <laughs> it is about five inches too small. <laughs> so. <laughs> I kind of hate it. <laughs> You're so cute though. Is you do kind of look like him. I seriously think it's just the nose. Yeah, it's like mine has like a little swoop to it. Mm-hmm. And like kind of points up so you can... The nostrils. See my, see my thoughts like someone so generously mentioned years ago. <laughs> Never forgot that comment. That was so funny. What do you rate this one? It, this is a complete opposite from Ace, so... It's comfy, I'll give you that. Between like the jeans and the... Yeah. And the hoodie. I, I honestly like, think... I like the jewelry. I just like, I couldn't get his hair down because... That's not how my hair is and I haven't had a haircut in months, so. Yeah, I think minus the eyeliner and all the chains, you would probably wear this look though. Yeah, I'll for sure wear this. I like this a lot. Yeah, that's cool. All right, so this is gonna be the last one. Um, this is probably one of my most highly requested things is to do a get the look and turn Patrick into Harry Styles because this has been an ongoing comment for years now, um, like six plus years, Patrick has been dealing with those comments, which is not a bad thing. He's not a bad person to be compared to, but people get really defensive over him. So I was a little bit nervous to do this, but whatever, we're here. It's all in good fun. Um, Harry has changed up his style quite a bit, which made this a little bit more fun. 
um, because his style is so unique and so cool now. I decided to recreate his look from his Fine Line album cover. So like the pink shirt, the white pants. It's gonna be a look. I'm excited to see what he looks like in it. <laughs> now I'm pretty sure he has most of them painted pink and then the pointer painted blue. His shirt right now is the are the exact colors oh, that right. were painting your nails. <laughs> Did you do that on purpose? I'd be lying if I said yes. Alright guys, it's not gonna be perfect, so don't come for me or Patrick. Let's do the we'll do blue first. The Wait, do we get a hand massage first? Isn't that how this works? <laughs> no. Demanding. Nails, check. Now I gotta wait for them to dry so you don't get them on these white pants you're about to get into. I'm gonna show you guys the outfit. So this was a little bit difficult to find because Mr. Styles is not your average dresser, okay, right? He's got a lot of cool outfits that he probably gets custom made. So not the easiest for me to find for this get the look, um, but you know, I went on ASOS like always. So I found this like satiny, oh my gosh, the satiny oversized shirt in the women's section um, because it was not easy to find this color and this fabric in the men's so I got it oversized and then I got some flared trousers now the only thing is I couldn't I ordered um, like little gold buttons to sew on the front to like match it a little bit better but they got lost in the mail so we're just gonna go without it um, also I couldn't find pink suspenders but I think this overall with the nail polish and then all of the jewelry um, will look really good and the black shoes I don't know if I said that I also got a watermelon, um, so we're gonna do the whole get up, take some photos, because I think I'm gonna use this one as the thumbnail, because why wouldn't I? Um, and I'm gonna text it to the girls. They know we're making this video, but I haven't shown them like the final look or anything, so I'll let you guys know what they think about it um, when it's all done. Like, yeah. It's just a lot of metal. I know. He's wearing a lot in the photo, though, so you should definitely wear all of them. I will show up my little collection here. He doesn't have that ring though, ew. <laughs> I don't know what to say about that. I was gonna make some quip about marrying him, but I'll start something I don't wanna get into. Nah, I choose you, bub. Pretty dang good. What do you think? <laughs> Man, these pants are pretty crazy, but uh. Yeah, also, can we talk about this? Mister, sir, nail polish. Guys, come on. Tell me I didn't nail that. Obviously, the gold buttons would have been just like all of it. Wait, why am I doing the hand thing in the album? <gasps> hey. It's fun for sure, these pants are crazy. It kind of reminds me of like Saturday Night Fever too. You know like John Travolta with his like flares? You know I owe you so big for this. Because you're, the comments are going to be hopefully nice, but otherwise you're in for, in for it. I love you. I appreciate you. Okay, I sent it in our family group chat, and they reacted just about how I thought they would. But that is it for the video today. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up for Patrick being such a trooper and like even letting me film this video and do this. So definitely give him a thumbs up. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.